the snow is back, unfortunately. Uh, I've been quiet the past week and a half. Uh, didn't mean to be. I did train at the weekend, two weekends ago now, I guess. Like I said I would, to try out my new bibs, and uh, they're really good, yeah. Uh, so good, in fact, uh, I bought another pair, which are apparently arriving later today. But, um, yeah, now I was supposed to do a video after last weekend, but unfortunately, I crashed on my bike on Tuesday. So I had my Corona jab, my third one, Tuesday morning, and then as I came home, Tuesday afternoon, I crashed on my bike. So I've been a bit tired, bruised, feeling sorry for myself. Uh, but I did start training again last Thursday, I think. And yeah, it went all right. Uh, struggling with my asthma still, unfortunately. Uh, so the VO2 max intervals have been tough. Threshold ones have been tough but the sweet spot ones have been quite manageable. So uh, I'm pleased I can do some training and I can do it so quickly after my third vaccine. After my second vaccine, it took two weeks until I had the energy to train again. So this is much better. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to pick up a few things from the office and uh, have some lunch over there. And uh, yeah, might even meet Sophie for lunch before she gets her third vaccine, so that's fun. Despite it being minus two, it's very slushy. I'm guessing they've sorted a lot, but uh, it makes it very tricky to cycle. I'm now just cycling on a very thin line of not slush, so I don't get too much spray. Today's outfit is uh, much more casual. Shows how little I ride in normal shoes. I still twisted my foot to try and unclip. It's obviously a reflex. This bridge has two sides. I want to be on that side to cycle over. I just don't know how to get there. Now the main reason why I chose to cycle in around lunch, daylight, woo! Also makes it much easier to spot where it might be slippery. Usually I go down there, but I think we'll, uh, we'll avoid that today. I crashed last week. Let's try and keep it rubber side down. I guess they're taking down the Christmas lights. And this, this is why I cycled. Just for lunch and picking some bits up during the day. Sunshine, snow, less traffic as well. Right, you might be wondering, why isn't my commuter bike the same as it was last year? Well, it got stolen, didn't it? So this is the new commuter. Specialized Cirrus X3 EQ. The EQ meaning equipped. So it has full mud guards, front and rear, dynamo hub uh, for dynamo lights, front and rear, parcel rack, and the most important thing, kickstand. Obviously, uh, I think the dynamo lights are probably the best feature because it means I always have lights with me. Um, but yeah, a few upgrades, obviously. Uh, much better saddle, uh, purple grips, purple bell, um, clipless pedals or semi-clipless. And then I've done a little bit of self-decals 
to make it a bit more reflective, more reflective and visible. Um, yeah, love it. Uh, kind of miss having drop bars sometimes, but otherwise it's a very comfortable position for cruising around town and going to and from work, um, casual and in cycling kit. Yeah, big fan. So he actually has a new commuter bike as well because her commuter bike was stolen after the summer. So mine was stolen immediately before or during, like June time. Very hard to get a bike then. Sophie's was stolen in August. Also hard to get a bike, but slightly easier. So both got new commuters. Both specialized Cirrus X's. Sophie's is a 2.0. Mine, as said, is a 3.0. Loving that, Wigo loves it too. It's uh, from Neat Cleats, it's a little helmet hanger. Delicious lunch, great getting out during the day as well. As you saw, blue skies, wow. But yeah, from my crash, I landed on my left side, got the jab in the right side, landed on the left side. So I was very sore last week, feeling a bit sorry for myself. So that's why I haven't posted any videos. I apologize. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.